Hi, Libra. This is Jeffrey. This is Ripe Color. This is the reading for October 17th through the 24th. Happy birthday to all my late Libras. And as some of you know, if you are a subscriber, not if you just watch it, if you're a subscriber and it happens to be your birthday this week and you happen to be watching this video, you can be as old as you like. Isn't that perfect? Makes you want to subscribe. All right. Um, Please like, share, subscribe, like, comment, and share, subscribe, do all that stuff. Press the bell for notifications. I offer private readings. I also offer IET, which is a healing modality. Uh, the information is below. I'm a textile artist, ripecolor.com. Ta da, ta da, ta da. Um, and I also make really cool t shirts. Okay. The other thing I wanted to say is. Um, my little pre-message is, you know, here we are closing out uh, Libra season, and it's like, I feel like you learned something. So what have you learned, and how can you take it with you, right? I feel like there was information gained, and now your job is to utilize it. Okay. I don't get that, you know, whatever, that's what I got. What I got. So my energy toward the reading is sort of like, what have you learned? One, two, three. Right. Go where it's warm. I think that's what you learned. Go where it's warm. Go where I'm nourished. Go, go where I'm appreciated. Uh, use my intuition and be able to like move on it, be able to, you know, utilize it and, and whoops. I think that's what you learned. I think that's what you learned. It's like, okay, well, that person uh, says one thing and does another. That's not a good thing. And now I have this other person or people or a situation around which feels really good and feels really right and feels really balanced. And um, I'm going to, you know, sit in that. I'm going to sit in that. I'm going to go after that. I'm going to uh, build that as opposed to they're there, they're not there. You know, they say one thing and they do another. They promise you the world and they offer nothing, la, la, la. Yeah, I think that you actually have a, idea and a strategy of how to go after these relationships that are more equal, that are healing, that are healing. This is also a card of healing. You know, it's Apollo, basically. I mean, that's, but it's Apollo. And Apollo has this energy of healing about him. Mm -hmm. You're the leader. You're the leader. It, you know what? It, it's also, it feels, so I'm getting that, you know, when you put your, um, when you hang your, uh, your uh, I don't know, possibilities, on, and it's not the right way to say it, your um, hopes on something outside of yourself or on something that's disappointing, it's like hanging your, your hat on a hook that's like not in the wall. And I think, you know, you've had that experience and you're like, no, 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 no. I want something stable, stable and solid and balanced and that I can rely on. You know, there's a sense of reliability with the emperor. Yeah, everything's about to change. It's all about to change. So you learned a lot. You learned a lot. I think you went through some disappointment, some weirdness, some uh, someone not showing up or uh, you know, a promise unfulfilled, but that's done. That's done. And you see where the future is. You, you see and feel where the future is, and you're going to go after it. Great. Yeah. And you're not afraid to work toward it. You're not afraid. You're not afraid to like really, you know, dive deep, which is good. Yeah. You're definitely moving to a new place. 
this old thing, you know, there was a certain satisfaction in it. You know, maybe you had a job, right, where the boss was kind of a monster, but the pay was good. And it's like, no, 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 I want more. I want more. Uh, I want to go to a place where the pay is good, maybe not as good, but it doesn't really matter because I, I need to feel um, appreciated, loved, and taken care of, and feel like I'm heard and uh, respected. That's that's the new turn of events. If I treat myself with respect, then I expect others to treat me with respect. And if they can't, and if they don't, and they won't, sayonara, Charlie. Yeah, because the other thing was an illusion. And this new, this new endeavor you're going on, you're not exactly sure where it's going. You just know that it's moving in that general direction because the other stuff, yeah, new thoughts, new ideas, new enthusiasm. And it comes really quickly, actually. This full moon's gonna be a doozy, baby. Yeah, celebration, muses. This is also, for me, this is the music, this is artistic creativity, right? This is celebration, this could be a wedding. You know, that's what you're looking for. You're looking, you know, to live a life of joy. And who can blame you? You know, honestly, the more I look at this reading, there's not one negative card. You could read every card as negative. You could read every card as positive too. But, you know, there are certain cards that are particularly dark, that are really hard to like, for me to put my positive spin on. And there's not a one here, not a one. You know, the only one that's a little bit funny, here, I'm gonna show you, here we go. The only one that's a little bit funny is the moon, but the moon could also be intuition. It's the mysterious path, it's being blessed. You know, you don't, you're not really quite sure where you're going. You know, it's a little bit foggy, but it's okay. This is direction here. There's direction here. There's direction here. There's direction here. There's direction here and here. So do you have to know the whole story? No. You know, so many times we have these things, or at least me, I have everything. Oh, well, it's got to be this way and that way. And it's like, well, just show up and see what happens. Just show up and see what happens. Because I feel like good things are happening and changing and moving. And um, I think you've, you know, learned this state, this sense of um, what your boundaries are, actually. That's what it feels like. That was. Not only did you learn the lesson, but you're actually going to uh, execute that plan you know, being around this and that, right? Uh, 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 being around that, as opposed to, you know, keep on doing the same thing over and over. I'll give you a really funny example. I met this guy and um, I said, let's meet at the Metropolitan Museum, right? And years ago, I always used to meet somebody on the steps. I said, I'll be in the lap. Blah, blah, blah. So I'm waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting and waiting. And usually like 15 minutes is about my limit. Sorry, you know, you didn't call me. You didn't, it's like, I, I got things to do. I ain't waiting. So it's like already into 20 minutes and then, oh, well, I'll be there in an hour. Anyway, you know how sometimes we're led by something that's not in our best interest. So I decide to walk across town to meet them through the park, uh, the upper part of the park, which is, can be very windy and very uh, kind of confusing, you know? And I don't know, I guess they were doing something with the horses or something. And there were these enormous piles of horse, you know what, all over the place with red flags in them. Red flags. I mean, talk about the universe talking to me. Uh, you know, should have turned around right then and there and gone back to the museum by myself, which I, I tried rather go to the museum by myself anyway. So I feel like you know, that's the lesson you learned and you don't have to like go see the red flags. It's like, no, I already got the story. I already got the clarity of the vision of, of where that is. 
And I choose not to even pay attention to it. I choose not to answer that phone call. I choose not to go after uh, something that I already know is, you know, the same old, same old. It's really time for something new. It's really time for something new. And I feel like it's very clear to you. And it's not even that big a deal to change your behavior, actually. It's like when you're done, when you're done. That's it. It's a nice reading, a really nice reading. All right. Blessings to you. Thanks for tuning in. Talk to you soon.